I think it's about that time. Hi, howdy, hello. It's not 11-11, but it's sometime slightly past thereof. And as usual, I'm here to do a quick body check, invite you to join me if you feel like it, to whatever degree you feel like it. I got a crack going on on my screen right near that camera, causing a little streakiness. So I'm enjoying that. I hope you are too. You're welcome. Ha! <sighs> Whether you choose to follow along or not, I hope to encourage you to take a deep breath. <sighs> let it go. Let go of some stress. Shake some of it off. Set some of it down. Whatever works for you. Mm. You're also welcome to follow along, but I encourage you to listen to your own body if you're doing that. I'm going to take a breath or so to just root myself into the earth by bringing my attention into the bottoms of my feet, making sure not to lock my knees, tipping the tailbone under just a little bit, nice and long and strong through the core, relaxing those shoulders. And then I'm going to roll on down, just checking in with the spine, nice and slow, one vertebra at a time, all the way past the waist to the hips. I don't know if I'm still in camera. I think I'm not. Let's see if I can adjust this just a little bit. There we go. Hanging here from the hips. Ah, just letting go of the spine and the neck and the head, letting gravity do some unwinding. Let's roll that up real slow, still one vertebra at a time. Just checking in with that spine, swinging the arms back, lifting the chest, pushing the hips forward. Come into a bit of a counter stretch. Ah. And then again from the hips, this time with a relatively flat back. Coming down from the hips into a forward fold again. Remembering to breathe, shaking off some stress, relaxing the belly. Relaxing the arms and the neck. Add a little weight to the head if that feels good. I'm going to come for a gentle twist over to the left. Back to center. And a gentle twist over to the right. Back to center. Mm. Bend the knees, swinging the arms back, coming back into that counter stretch, just letting the arms dangle back, lifting the chest, lifting the eyes, pushing those hips forward. And coming back to standing. I'm going to come into a forward fold from the waist now for contrast. So going up in the pelvic floor, back in the abdomen, rounding the spine. Left elbow over right the first time, pulling these shoulder blades apart, tucking the chin, just giving myself a nice hug and really rounding the spine. Squeeze the shoulders if that feels good. <sighs> and then releasing all of that from the hips again. Down into a forward fold, relaxing the belly, relatively straight spine. Shaking that out, and then I'm going to come up again, this time right elbow over left, again pulling up and back, tucking the chin, rounding the spine, pulling the shoulder blades apart, which feels really good. I'm trying to make sure I'm not lock those knees, tucking the tailbone. Mm, and releasing all of that again from the hips. And roll back up. One vertebra at a time. Shake that off. 
little bit. Adjust this again for standing up. We're just doing the best we can with what we have from where I am. And I had to change that up so it rhymes. Standing in a straddle position with feet facing forward. Bend those knees a little bit. Or at least keep them not locked. And I'm going to do some stretching in the inner thigh and lower leg by dipping the hip, dipping on the right, and dipping on the left. At least for me, that brings a stretch into the inside of the leg, a little bit into the hip. Again, I encourage you to listen to your own body. Be respectful and mindful of your own body. Mostly it's about checking in. <sighs> Letting go of some stress. Hopefully doing a little movement. Maybe bringing a little silliness and lightheartedness to your day. Dipping again on the left. And on the right. I'm going to walk these feet in. Alternating till the feet are under the hips. Then bending the knees a little bit. I'm going to push into one side, taking the weight off the right, pushing into the left. Taking weight off the left, pushing into the right. Again, be very mindful and listen to your own body. Sounds like somebody's getting tortured out there. Pushing into the right. Sounds like a bird killing a bird to me. But you may have to go check. Hmm. Hmm. Pushing again into the right. A little bit deeper now. I'm going to warm that up to roll that around a little bit in the hip socket. Again, don't push it too far. The point is just to keep that limber and check in with it. And now bringing the feet back under these hip bones. Bending the knees a little bit. I'm going to slide over to the left, trying to keep both feet well grounded. For me, that brings a stretch up into the torso. Over to the left and then sliding over to the right. Again, trying to keep both feet rooted into the earth. It's challenging for me. That's why I restate it. Sliding over to the right. Sliding over to the left. And then over to the right. And over to the left. Back to center. Let's just shake it all out. Hmm. Do a little arm stretching. Bring this left arm across the body. The shoulder a nice stretch. The arm a nice stretch. Releasing that. Bring the right arm across the body. Just moving that shoulder around. Getting a little stretch on that side. Letting that go. Let's bring arms behind back. Clasping hands. Rolling shoulders together. Rolling elbows towards each other, pressing palms, and then into that counter stretch, back bend a little bit. And then bending from the hips again with a relatively straight back, bringing those arms with me. Actively pulling those arms together to get a nice stretch through the chest, through the shoulders. Ah. <sighs> Tracing my triceratops line, I like to imagine. And I'll try twisting to each side. And back to center and then pushing through the bottoms of the feet with a relatively straight back. And all of that up and back into that counter stretch. Pushing the hips forward, pulling the arms down. Just getting a 
nice stretch. My arm's going to numb, so I gotta shake them out for a little bit. My arms are healing up well, but uh, I've had quite the reminder of being more mindful and pushing my body less, which is not what I'm used to, but is what I'm practicing. I hope that you are finding lots of good things to practice that feel good in your body. Mm -hmm. Thank you for stopping by. If you do, I want to remind you to give yourself a little love because you are worth it. I wish you a fantastic day. I'll be seeing you. Ciao for now.